Hello children. Today we will learn about how to operate a paint. This is your paint window. I'll give you a quick introduction of this paint window. So this all is your ribbon. This is called as ribbon. These three save, undo, redo. These are your quick access toolbar. It is called as quick access toolbar. These are the tools of the paint. These are the different brushes. These many brushes are there in the paint. These are the tools which are ready made available in MS Paint. These are the color groups. And this is your working area where you are actually going to draw a picture. Now let's start with the pencil tool. So this is your pencil tool. Children, as you move your mouse pointer over the tool, it will show you the name of that particular tool. As you can see, this is filled with color this is text tool so let's begin with the pencil tool pencil tool works same like your own pencil it is used to draw a free form line or curves see you can draw any picture the way you draw by using your own pencil in the notebook or paper ready next is your fill with color tool it is used to apply color you have to just select the fill with color tool go to the color box select any any color of your choice and just click on the particular area where you want to apply the color isn't it beautiful so this is your pencil tool next coming to text tool this is your text tool you have to just select the text tool, come to the drawing area, drag it over the drawing area. One rectangular box with the blinking cursor will appear and you can type any name to your drawing. As you have seen, I have typed flower. If you want to change the color size of this, you have to just select this. Then go to here. You can change any any font then font size underline italic bold and you can change the color of this also I believe isn't it nice next is your eraser tool eraser tool also works like your own eraser just you have to select the eraser tool go to the drawing area and drag it your drawing will get erased if you click here and if you press ctrl Z again your drawing will appear as it is See, I'm pressing ctrl Z yeah but now I want to erase it you can do one more thing that is go to the select option select your drawing and just press delete key from the keyboard your drawing will get erased now next to the tools these are the ready-made tools children which are available let's see one by one first is your line tool once you select the line tool you can change the size of the line tool this is thin thick thicker thickest we will select the thickest one and the line tool is used to draw a sleeping line oh I, I did not change the color of this let's take a black color again you can draw sleeping line standing line slanting line like this by using line tool next coming to curve tool curve tool is used to draw mountains or any curve line see I'm drawing mountains how to use it you have to select the curve tool then draw a line come to the middle of the line and drag your line up click one more time your mountain will get drawn see this is all about curve tool next is your oval tool oval tool is used to draw a circle 
or oval you can change the size of it also like this you can just select it once you draw it you can change the size like this you have to just click on this corner arrows and drag the mouse now I have shown you how to color with feel with color tool now let's see the brushes you have to just go to brushes select any of the brush tool of your choice then select the color and just apply it like your sketch pen or crayons the way you apply see the color is getting applied to your picture now this was very thick brush let's go to another brush it is little bit thinner see so this is all about your brushes or else you can go to again fill with color tool select any color and just click once in a picture or shape the color will get applied next coming to the rectangle tool rectangle tool is used to draw a square or rectangle the same way you have to select the rectangle tool from the shapes and just drag it over the area that's it next is rounded rectangle this also works like a rectangle tool only it is having the rounds in these four corners that's why it is called as rounded rectangle tool then first I'll erase all this drawing because we don't have place then next is polygon tool polygon tool is used to draw a polygon like this this is a polygon tool next is triangle tool triangle tool is used to draw a triangle the same way you can use these different shapes to draw in your working area do you understand children now how to use it now let's draw a beautiful drawing by using all the tools we have learned I will draw a house by using triangle tool rectangle tool polygon tool again I will select rectangle tool oh, I'm so sorry so I select polygon tool only or else let's draw it with the line tool it will be easy now I'll select rounded rectangle tool and I'll draw the windows let's make it small then I'll draw a circle tool, I'll draw a circle over here and select rectangle tool and I'll draw the door now let's apply some color by using feel with color tool I like brown color then I'll select yellow color then house will be of orange color light yellow how is it? now last is your text tool thank you for watching bye bye